Good morning, friends. Um, here with the weekly update. It is um, September 12th, 2016. Um, just doing our check-in. Uh, you know, kind of looking back on last week. Uh, had a good, pretty productive week. Um, and I talked a little bit last week about working on trying to establish a habit of getting up and getting the day started early. Um, that went really well. Uh, been started before six every day. Uh, I'm working my way towards five, trying to get to where I'm getting started at five. So I have time to sit and read and kind of just get my mind and things going before I really get the day started. Um, did a lot of work prepping and planting out the fall stuff last week. Um, got in some more carrots, uh, salad greens, some beets, radishes, turnips. Um, still working on planting more uh, fall stuff this week. Uh, trying to get some lettuce seeded. Uh, we've got some broccoli that may be ready to transplant. Um, I also did a lot of work uh, trying to get control some weeds and things and get stuff ready in the high tunnel to to plant. Um, you know, looking ahead, we're probably two weeks from really having just a lot of winter squash ready. Um, pumpkins are running really behind, so hopefully they'll start to get ready soon. Um, I'd like to have them out by the end of the month or really early next month so we don't miss a window on that. Um, got going ahead, I this last week I got our next batch of broiler chickens ordered. Um, so another 300 chickens that they'll be here on, uh, should be here on Wednesday the 21st. Um, you know, we leave the next day to go to a wedding a couple states away and we'll have some friends farm sitting the farm. Um, so hopefully they're here before we leave. Um, kind of looking ahead, but excited about that. That'll be the first time that our whole family has left the farm, uh, since we came back in three years um, you know different parts of us have gone at one time but uh, my parents and my brother and Bethany and I have not all been away from the farm at the same time um, in that time we because somebody has to be here to keep things fed and going so we're, we're really excited about that um, we've got uh, our market on Saturday, um, our buying groups on Tuesday. So far, uh, we're, we've decided to kind of help manage inventory a little bit to do a 20% off special on our chicken wings. Um, this is the first time we've ever ran a discount. Um, it still keeps it a little bit higher than our bulk price, but uh, it makes it for, makes it a really good deal for people. Um, and it's working. Uh, chicken wings so far have been a really unpopular cut of meat for us to sell. And uh, we've moved quite a few chicken wings so far this month. So hopefully that continues. Um, kind of on the personal development side of things, I'm really trying to focus this week on uh, getting a good system down for managing my tasks and my to-dos so I can you know, I, on the farm there's always something that needs attention or needs doing and it's really easy to stay busy on busy work and not necessarily the things that are really moving you forward. And so uh, right now I'm trying out a web app and a phone app uh, called Workflow, which uh, it look, just looks like an outline um, and it lets you categorize and build lists in that way. Um, so I'm kind of trying to divide everything up between short range tasks and medium range and long range tasks um, just to kind of help prioritize things. So I'll keep you guys updated on how that's going. Um, so far I really like it. Um, working on continuing to work on uh, sleep and uh, trying to get a little more sleep, but to establish that pattern of getting up early. Um, I'd like to really start trying to work in um, just a little bit of intentional 
exercise in the mornings first thing is when I wake up. Um, I do a lot of physical stuff throughout the day uh, outside. Um, but to have that uh, intentional, like dedicated exercise first thing in the morning to even just a little bit to kind of help jumpstart blood flow and your metabolism and really get your body going, I think can be really helpful and beneficial. So uh, I'm going to try to start adding that in, um, but cr trying to create a lot of habits here all at once. So um, I'll keep you posted on where I'm at with those as well. Um, we're going to head to the week. We've got on Wednesday, I, our turkeys go to the butcher. They'll be 16 weeks old. Um, they look like they've got some pretty good size. Uh, you know, we had a lot of trouble in the brooder. We started with 100 turkeys and uh, we've got, should have 57 of them right now. Um, so we, we had a lot of loss really early on, but once they got outside on the pasture, I don't believe we've lost a single turkey. Um, I'm really happy with the ones that made it outside the way that they look. So uh, we'll be getting ready to offer those for sale in the coming weeks. So excited to take our first batch of turkeys to the butcher. We did a little batch last year that we butchered ourselves. Um, that's a big undertaking, um, even in relation to the chickens, because we've done the chickens before. But uh, so excited to see how that goes. Um, excited. We got to get a little more lettuce seeded this week. We've had a lot of trouble getting lettuce to germinate. It's been hot, um, but we've kind of had a cool down this week. So I'm hoping I'll be able to get some lettuce germinated and start it going and uh, start turning things over to looking towards fall and winter. Um, so I hope you guys have a good and productive week, and we'll check back in next week.